Okay, so, as someone who is a bit of a fan of the manga Tokyo Ghoul, I was pretty stoked to learn the news some time ago that the manga Suishida was working on a new series. Even though I really like Tokyo Ghoul and its sequel Tokyo Ghoul Re, I do think there are some issues in regards to Ishida's writing, mostly to how he can go a little too far in some instances, example being a good portion of the villains in TG tend to be freaking crazy because of course they are, as well as other things that I do take issue with. I don't know when or if that I will ever cover TG at all in its entirety. It's been a while since I've reread the series in full, but like many things, I might get to it when I can. Jojen X, however, from the 15 chapters I've read from it, does show some level of potential. The main character, Tokyo, funny enough, kind of starts out similar to Kaneki in a way, but that does change as the series progresses, as he partners with Otto, the secondary MC, and the two do banter back and forth in a couple of chapters. So it is clear almost from the get-go, Jojen X is not going to be as bleak or as grim as Tokyo Ghoul is, and from what I've heard from other people who have read Jojen X and are up to date on it, it's clear that Tokyo Ghoul is the darker of the two mangas. Now, this is not a good thing or a bad thing, but rather a funny observation. This could be due to either Ishida trying out something different or him wanting to write something not as bleak as his previous work. For all we know, he could have a desire to write something that has a lot more in common to an action series as opposed to a drama series. So far from what I've read, X does resemble a few popular shonen manga at the moment in some aspects. Them being demons or humans with demon powers, working with an organization that hunts down other rogue demons and monsters, Jujutsu Kaisen, Chainsaw Man, etc. You know what I mean. Which is kind of funny since from where I can see, the series is officially designated as a seinen rather than a shonen. To my surprise, the action in the series is quite spot on. And what I mean by this, and I will have to ask some of the Tokyo Ghoul fans in the room to bear with me for a split sec, is that... Ishida for a while was not the best when it came to doing action scenes. There were a few instances where sometimes things would be quite chaotic. Some scenes would require a double take. I remember when Re was still releasing and after a chapter, people thought several characters were killed off in one page due to how the action was framed. But then the next chapter came out and it turned out no one died. But due to how Ishida framed it, things did look a little off and people made the assumption. But, it is clear that Ishida recently has improved massively in regards to his action scenes. Framing and choreography, if that's the right word, have definitely improved, and it's nice to see the guy still make some progress in his art. So far from what I've read, the narrative, as mentioned before, is rather safer than TG, this bearing some striking similarities to most shonen series that I've mentioned earlier. But, that does not mean there aren't some developments happening as the story unfolds. It is quite clear I need to read some more before I make any more statements, but I will say, things are definitely shaping up. And as I mentioned before, this is Ishida after all. It's quite clear he's using the beginning to his advantage to lure people in, who later give him a false sense of security and then just slap them across the face with something massive that will happen later on in the series. I mean, this is the guy who gave us Tokyo Ghoul after all, and that series has multiple plot reveals, twists, and turns that happen in it. But knowing him, it might happen later on down the line. Regardless, Chosen X does have my attention, and I will be catching up to it in the future when I have the time. And I do hear some promising things in regards to what happens later in the manga. So yeah, so far those are my thoughts on the manga Chosen X. As usual, if you have any recommendations for me, link them in the Discord or in the comments. Hope you guys take care, stay chill wanderers.